In our lesson today, we're going to learn how to create a painting using bubbles. So what we're going to need are some paints, or you could use food coloring, uh, some straws, or a straw, some containers for your water and your paint mixture, some sugar. You can do it without sugar, but the sugar helps to mix it. And uh, some, I've got some body wash, but you can use um, dishwashing liquid or any kind of mixture that makes bubbles and because my paint's quite thick I'm going to put the paint in first so I'll put a small amount of paint into one container and then I'll put a bit of sugar in there a squirt of the body wash and then some water. And I'll just put a small amount of water in to begin with and I'm going to give it a good stir so that it mixes up all of the ingredients. try it out. So I've got three different blues so I'm going to attempt to make a multicoloured blue bubble picture because what we're trying to get is a nice watery effect because we're thinking about how much water there is in the rainforest. So I'm going to take my straw and I'm going to blow some bubbles. Now that I've blown my bubbles, what I can do is take some paper and just place it on top of the bubbles. And we should have some bubble effect. It hasn't come out very blue, so I think I might add some more paint into my mixture. In fact, I think I'll try some of this purple. Again, I'm going to add the sugar and the bubbles. And some water. A little bit to begin with, so it's easier to mix. And then I'll add some water to it. So that it's deep enough to blow my bubbles in. And I'm going to use the same piece of paper and see what happens. Okay. starting to add more and more layers create our watery effect, bubbly background. <laughs> 